All right, let's take a look at all of the fun stuff that we pulled out of the first five feet of the little tiny barn. I don't think I've shown you this barn, but let's go take a look. So this is probably the oldest barn on the farm. And so it's got a lot of log components, but it's also got hewn wood. And then it's got the hand hewn lumber too. But yeah, like a lot of stuff in this barn, there is stuff everywhere, literal stuff everywhere. So just so you guys know, so you're not worried about it, this whole barn is going to get saved and it is savable. It's totally savable. It's just like everything. It's how much are you going to pay and how can you do it? Right? So yeah. There's 120 years of stuff in this barn and that's just what it is. And so there's lots of mice, there's a dead mice, <laughs> lots of doors. I think farmers would have collected doors, but like there's so many memories just piled up in this old barn along with alternators. Let's go over here. So I don't know why there's walls in some places, and why there's not walls in other places, but this I think is a barrel. Oh, hold on, I'm gonna walk over here. Oh, that is like completely disconnected. I haven't actually been over in this side of the barn. This is the first time I've been over here. But like, look at, I mean, some people would think that this is crazy, but I think a lot of people would think that we were crazy actually, but it's beautiful. It's so beautiful. It's a bunch of old windows to find where those go. And a bunch of lumber that we can, we can use. And those slats were probably I wonder if they had animals in here. I mean, it would make sense, but like, it's so beautiful. The whole thing is so lovely. But yeah, it needs, it needs a lot of help. It needs a lot of help. A tree limb took this down here. I'll take you outside and I'll show you the outside of the barn. nothing. I'm just taking people on a tour. So there's the window. So this would have been like a corn crib kind of thing. That's what the barn guy told us because it's off the ground. And because it's off the ground, that means that the rodentia, well, maybe have a harder time getting in there. Oh, all that stuff needs to come down. That's where that log, tree limb, took a nice big chunk out of the, out of the side of the barn. And you can see where something's been living in between the sides. But yeah, she still stands. We'll get her fixed up. There's probably another window over there. Let me back up a little bit so you can see her in all of her glory. But yeah. Yeah, we're going to need a lot of help. And that's not even to mention the, the other barns. So you get a nice... That one we're taking apart to save the rest. This one, the corn crib. Beautiful corn crib. I'll take you on a tour later. It's our neighbor's house. That's where the old chicken coop was. That pile of brush way back there, this one, that's where the outhouse was. But yeah, this is like the back side of the house. Cool.